All right, this is it. This is my little apartment. Nothing like a Michelin chef like yourself can afford. Um, I afforded this place from some secret money from my dad that I had stashed up. And I, I wanna warn you, it's just a little messy. Haven't really been in here since the whole Warren thing, but happy you're gonna see it. Eh, taste buds don't judge a dish on portion size. It's about quality, you know? I'm just happy to, happy to see something that belongs to you. Get to know you better, you know? You're the sweetest. All right, let's see Melissa's abode. Go ahead, step inside, don't be afraid. What are your first impressions? Uh, you have baby Chris in here often? Would you want to go six months without seeing your grandchild because of a custody order? if you were in my shoes? Of course I wouldn't. But every time you make an attempt to see a grandkid, you're villainized. Everyone thinks you're causing a problem. Recently, have I done anything malicious to Miranda, aside from speaking my mind? Have I planned anything against her? Have I done anything underhand? Nah, I'll be honest with you, I think you've been a good form of mother-in-law. So, but no one's gonna give you credit for that. Did I or did I not go against my own son? in the custody hearing to help her. You did. You did the unthinkable. You went against your blood, your own son, and you got nothing in return. Nothing. No one's saying nothing about that. I understand she doesn't want to mess with her custody order. She doesn't want to mess things up. So I don't see anything wrong with me filing a petition as a grandparent to be added to the custody list so that I have visitation rights. It's that an evil thing to do. I wholeheartedly agree with you. 100%. But everyone's gonna spin it that you're causing problems. You trying to see a grandson makes you the villain. Everyone's gonna say that. About what people say, it's about me seeing my grandchild. I googled it. Take a look at what it says about filing a petition. Yeah, it's a common thing. I didn't know that grandparents are entitled to those types of things. That's good to know. But again, even no matter how common it is, no matter how many grandparents do it, because you're doing it, everyone's gonna have a problem with it. Six months, Joey gets supervised visits and none of the, none of the other family get to see him. All I'm asking for is 10 to 20 minutes out of the week to see my grandchild. I really don't think at this point that that's an evil thing to do. Yeah, you're gonna file the petition and your, your daughter-in-law's gonna blame you. Everyone's gonna say you're causing problems, but here's the funny thing. If you didn't file the petition, everyone in the family would say that you're not making an attempt with your grandkid. That's what she would say. 